We're doing a declaw on this cat. And one thing that a surgical laser allows us is to do this now, I think probably a, with a more ethical standpoint as well as um, you know, less pain. We're gonna have less pain, less swelling. We're gonna seal nerve endings as well as blood vessels. And with a scalpel, those things aren't possible. First incision is really just through the skin. It doesn't have to be pretty and we're not gonna hurt any structures. The laser you do want to be perpendicular to what you're cutting. Just through the skin. I'm gonna turn to get the other side again, all the way over, stay perpendicular to the tissue I'm cutting. And as you get better, you can turn the claw upright as you come along. That actually was just getting through the skin, but I did hit all the way through and open up the joint with that first incision, being this is a small catch. That's actually opened up the joint and cleaned it up. Next are collateral ligaments. They run top to bottom, P2 to P3. As you cut them, you'll see P2 sink away. You have to do it on both sides. This side, you can visualize that collateral very nicely. Can you appreciate there's white band of tissue connecting P2 to P3, right there, right where my red diode is. I'm gonna aim right at that tissue. And as I do, you can see P2 sinking away. The third cut, the first one was dorsal ligament, collaterals. This is gonna get our deep digital flexor tendon. I call it my little smile. I'm gonna come around the back of P3 and release that deep digital tendon. When you do, P2 falls away. The last step is removing the tissue that's hanging onto P2. I'm walking it off. Now I'm seeing the tissue move and I know I'm right up against P3. So I've removed the claw. The black on that nail that's P3, I'm gonna remove it. I'd rather hit this than P2. So there, that's removal. No bleeding, no swelling, that's it.